Hello, this is Crystal Hale here with WN Streaming Solutions. This what I'm going to show you today is how to register your station with Shoutcast. Shoutcast is one of the is what many of you all uses, and that's what we have most of you. Well, everybody should be set up on Shoutcast unless you're an older client and you're on the old Icecast. So Shoutcast, if you go to Shoutcast.com, you'll see it's one of the uh, leading thing. Many of you are asking, how do I monetize my stream? How can I insert ads? This, that, or the other. Well, Shoutcast, a lot, they work with Radio Spot radio spot which also allows you to just enter in the information within a stream and it'll uh and target spot will send ads according to your location if that's something that you want to do what the great thing is about shoutcast it does provide a um a ranking system as well so you can go you can see you can pick the genre this is important so you'll know where to set it so if you're a christian if you're in if you're a christian station you're not going to list it as christian you're going to list it as inspirational so once you do inspirational as you see there's different categories there's christian and if you see you know your station has to be registered and if your station is registered or whatever i mean it'll go from who has no listeners to the top listeners right now, they only have 441 listeners, okay? So if you're just Christian in general, you got Christian metal. So look at this. Under Christian metal, there's only, this person is right here at the top, and they only have eight listeners. Christian rap. If you're Christian rap, this only person has only two listeners. So if you have a Christian rap station, guess what? And you have over two listeners, you're going to be in the top and people are able to either listen. See, I ain't going to play it all the way because I don't want to get a thing. Or they can download your stream to their, their player and you it open up PLS, any M3U, whatever. Okay. And this is real cool. And for contemporary gospel. Okay. This one station, I am contemporary, only have 37 listeners. And many of you who are on our networks have way more than 37 listeners. No wonder you should you shouldn't be in the top here. So that's what we're gonna show you how to uh, how to get this. This is great because not too many um, not too many people know how to register their stations and whatnot. So you can really really open it because it's great if you are number you're you're main number one for weeks and weeks and weeks in this shoutcast directory guess what you're gonna your station is gonna get noticed so let's go let's go ahead and log into our uh our station and let's go ahead and create um and create like sermons and services okay this is what we're gonna list um um uh master touch with today under sermons and sermons and sermons and services so if that's all you do is have sermons and services guess what this person only has 11 listeners we can easily garner 10 15 20 listeners or even more than that within a matter of seconds and guess what the sermon and services section will be number one so that's what um, we're going to register to do today so if you're on server one the same the same thing applies to um server two as well in server on server one and two you have centova on server two we'll go that one if you're on server two i'll show you how to do that on that okay so what you're going to do is you're going to log in there once you log in you're going to go to settings and make sure click right here to get your administrative path your administrative password once you get your administrative password just copy and paste it um copy it go over here to quick links you're going to click on what it says, your server streaming index. Once you click on your server streaming index, you're going to where it says, please log in. Your username is going to be admin. And then your password is whatever your administrative password is. And I got to change it because I think I showed y'all my the administrative password. Um, once you go in there, you're going to see this sign right here that says create alt is, is uh, alt alt. alt a-U-T-H-A-H-A-S-H, okay? Oh, but before you do that, make sure your, your, your setting is like public, okay? So you're gonna go to where it says um, server overrides. You're gonna make this public, and then you're gonna say update like that, okay? Make sure you update that because you want it public, otherwise it can't read it. 
So now we're going to go back to the server. You're going to click create authentic is a authentication hash is what it's called. Once you do that, you have the name of the radio station. You need to give the radio station a description. Okay, um, empowering and affecting the community by using everything because that's their thing. Okay, and so empowerment and um, with, with keywords preaching you just use um you just space okay preaching um use empowerment preaching uh teaching you know you can use whatever type of keywords you want i'm not doing seo today so but i'm gonna put gospel preaching it may it may that's about it okay and then you're gonna put a contact email since i manage this i'm gonna put my email address which is production well one of them at way network tv.net now here we go remember we had our genre the same thing that was on the shoutcast okay see you have a genre so once you do the genre we're going to do inspirational once we do inspirational we're going to put it under remember we had those categories so that, this one is going to go under sermon and services once i put it on sermon and services i'm going to uh, make sure my language is set to English, the country, the United States. I'm going to put where I'm from and then where our church is located, which is Wilmer. And then I'm going to create one. Okay. So it's, then it's telling me your, your authentication tag, whatever has been um, created. Right. So let's make sure of that oh lord have mercy let's go back okay so as you see i need to update this because guess what i didn't put the website network or you put whatever your website is but i needed to do that okay so once i do that but as you see my thing is set on private so it didn't give me a thing and i thought i restarted that server guess i didn't so remember when we went over here and we have this as public then we're going to update but when you update you have to make sure you restart the server and that's what i did not do okay so if you don't restart the server then you're not going to get that listing like you need because it has to be a public so the other server can access it okay now the stream has restarted successfully and um there so when i go here and i should be able to do this now this is empty so we're going to create that master such radio and empowering the community to use everything then contact oh website actually I'm gonna put okay we'll just wait now we're dealing with it so we're gonna put inspirational sermons and services then we're gonna go maybe Walmart okay we put we're in Texas, then create. Okay, we're gonna click there to return. Now it gives us a um, a directory ID. Okay, so now when I um, when I click when I click there, oh, it gives it gives me the thing to download. So now when I go to when I go to Shoutcast, and it could take up to ten minutes. For the for for it to list, but if I go to Shoutcast, here we go with Masters Touch Radio, and then if I right now, as you see, we're right we're like not that far on a thing. So if I if I actually were to were to tune in to Masters Touch Radio, 
And uh, okay, I'm gonna log into it. And I don't know how long it takes from when someone is um, actually listening to it for it to pop up. But if we go here, inspirational, and we go to so sermons and uh, services, right? And guess what? Master's Touch Radio is going to um, come up there. And once, um, some, once it starts reading um the listeners there let me go here because i just well it's saying i got one listener so it should so this is gonna update soon i'm not for sure how long it takes to update per se so let's masters touch radio Let's see, what is my radio station listed as? Yeah, oh, Master's Apostrophe. So, so there goes, there's goes Master's Touch. And as you see, whatever is playing on there is what's going to be playing. And soon, it's going to calculate our listeners, but I don't know how long it takes for them because I'm logged in on my phone. And listening to it as well so i'm not for sure updating wise how long it takes for them to um how how long for it takes but as you see you're all you're automatically entered on a shout cast and so once i figure out how long it takes or how long the um listener have to be logged in before it counts the listener um yeah all right so that's how you do that god bless you and i hope you enjoyed the tutorial <laughs>